What's up, Wavers? It's your boy Keys, aka Keys Boy Four, man. Coming back at you with another vid, man. Give me all the best tips and everything you need to enhance your waves in every, every aspect. As usual, we're gonna keep it going. This time on how to work that crown, man. I know a lot. That's one of the toughest areas that us waivers we definitely have problems with, man. Is that crown? And I'm gonna help you give you a little method that I use to close my crown up and get that spinning or the Doppler effect of the crown, man. And because it's definitely an area that you want to improve, you know what I mean, to get the full 360 wave effect. So all of what you're gonna need is Edge Tastic by Wave Builder. This shit right here good for all the it help. It's good for your sides too. If you got hard to wave sides and you it's hard to get waves on those right and left sides, which I know everybody didn't go went through. Just get try this. It's also good for that crown because that crown is also a tough ass area, man. Like all all y'all know, I know y'all know that. But also you gonna use I use my method is this little mini brush. It's a mini joint, man. I thought it was a fucking keychain brush when I first seen them. I don't want that little ass brush, but found out it's the crown. So it's good for your crown area, man. Because you're not going to use your whole head with it because you're going to be defeating the fact, defeating the purpose. Because it's not going to get you nothing done with this little ass brush. you be brushing all day. So it's just for your crown. And you'll need you a small tooth comb as well. You're going to crown, you're going to comb your crown. And you're going to need your hard brush. Get your hard crown brush, your Diane, whatever you use. And you don't need to get your soft brush. And it should only take you about 10 to 15 minutes. Try to, if you really want to work on your crown, take like 10, 15 minutes before you do a brushing session. You know what I mean? And get your crown there. You do that at least twice a day. And I'm telling you, by then, about a month or two, you'll start seeing the results in your crown just like I did. I mean, but you got to be dedicated to it. Or just like, just, just in the wave game, period. Y'all know you got to be dedicated to it if you want to see real results and shit. And y'all already know that, though, right? You know, just all the newbies though that don't know. My true waivers know what it is of putting that grind and that sweat in it. Just starting in, man, we gonna just, just wet, wet your hair. Just wet your crown here, not your whole hair. And wet your crown here. Just wet it a little bit. Just wet it. Also essential. Essential, you're gonna need that mirror. You're gonna need that mirror so you can see what you brush. Go ahead and brush the water in a little bit. Now, the key is brush, brush your head in the pattern that you brush with the big brush. If you want that spinning effect, brush in the same motion that you brush your regular head that you brush with the big brush. Just brush. Get it in there. But you go around once, brush water, and then comb it. Comb it in that area, man. Comb it. Don't be afraid to comb it. The comb it help you mold it with the direction that you want your crown to go. After you did that for a second, go ahead and get your edge chastity. You ain't gonna need a lot. Need about a fingertip full. About that much. Rub it in on your four fingers. And just apply it to your, to your crown area, man. Only your crown. I mean, you can use it on your whole head if you want to, because it's good for that. But I'm cool. I'm, I'm closing up my crown even more right now because I want that spinning crown. And that's why I was brushing that way. And that's why I was combing that way because I want my crown to get the little spinning effect in it. Go ahead and I'll do that. A little spinning on it. And what's the thing? Then I go about 10 minutes, man. I get my. 
Go ahead and I comb it in. I comb it in one more time. Comb it in the direction I want it to go. And now I'm brushing. Get the, my mini brush. It works oh so wonder. And I brush. Brush like 10 minutes, man. I'm brushing. Just my little mini crown area. Drop the motherfucking bird. I just go all the way around, man, about 10 15 minutes. It's gonna help you get that spiral effect on your crown. And that's it. Let's keep on knocking those strokes back. Close that crown up. Close it up. It's worked for me, man. It might not work for you, but I'm guaranteed that this this will work for you if you're using the edge tastic. And you go with that, man, for about 10 minutes. Like I said, I ain't gonna waste, I ain't gonna do the whole 10 minutes because this, you know what I mean, wasting a lot of time. Then after that, I just go, I brush it with the soft for another like five minutes. I don't have a soft crown brushes on the way in the mail, so gotta take what I got and I'll just brush it with a soft brush. Once again, this will help you get that, that 360 spinning effect in your crown or the Doppler effect in your crown. The Doppler effect is just when it's spread out evenly over different directions. And it's worked for me a lot, man. My crown used to be big as fuck. You big as the motherfucking Atlantic Ocean. I do that, man. That's how you do your crown, man. That's crown work for you right there. You gotta be consistent with it. You know what I'm saying? Subscribe right here. Right here. Not right there. Right here. For the best videos, man, the wave tips and everything y'all need, man. Fuck with me one more time. Showing y'all love by putting in these time, putting in these videos. Help y'all out. Get y'all, because I want everybody to be chopping, man. These waves ain't just waves. It's a lifestyle, as y'all know. So, let's get to it. Let's put in that work, man. Let's everybody get to chopping. Ain't no sense having no faith if you ain't chopping. Holla at me, man. Subscribe right here. Holla at me. One.